Oh, hello. Hi. Sorry, I'm reading this. Hi. Um, I'm Natty Bo Suicide. You can um, click the link in that little uh, caption there and find me on the Suicide Girl face, um, Suicide Girl site. Hold on, stop. My cat's getting in the way. Hello, how are you guys? Um, I am from Baltimore, Maryland. Uh, I'm, it's a pretty ugly day outside, so I'm inside. It's been dark and gloomy. Hello, hello. Hi, friends. But yeah, uh, it's been a really dark and gloomy day here in Baltimore. It's there's it's been like dark and gloomy days for the last couple days, really. Thank you. Hello, Louisiana. I've been having such a fine time with these uh, live Facebook feeds, so I'm doing one again. Um, I had no idea, I just like realized while I was getting on this live that um, Suicide Girls posted me on Facebook yesterday. Um, if you saw the picture on the, um, the under boob girl with the bee tattoo, um, I'm Natty Bo Suicide. It's funny, I read a comment on that picture that somebody wrote that was saying how like, I better be from Maryland because my name is Natty Bo and how sacrilegious it was. And, I'm from Maryland, so go fuck yourself. <laughs> oh, nice. Aberdeen's um, a little bit away, but Aberdeen's Maryland. Hey, I'm um, from technically from Miami, but I, um, I'm in Baltimore. Yay, yeah. If you're a Suicide Girl member, um, follow me on there. What's up, South Africa? Ohio, oh my goodness. I have a joke, <laughs> thanks. Arizona, hello. Um, so yeah, what's going on with you guys? Thanks, I like I don't like my teeth actually. Do a front flip? No, I'm not gonna do a front flip. <laughs> What's your favorite cereal? I like granola. Is that is that okay? I really the granola is my favorite. I need more whiskey. Not opposed against you. Just thought. <laughs> then go get yourself some more whiskey, friends. Of my wife. Oh, that's nice. Yay! Frames too dark. Um, okay, I don't really care what you think about my <laughs> glasses. You're, or am I coming to New Haven in May? Why? What's in May? Yeah, see, I like my glasses too, so. <laughs> Flash. No, um, we're on Facebook, um, and Facebook has, um, Facebook has rules, and so I can't get naked on Facebook, but there's... Plenty of places you can see me naked. Um, if you're a member of Suicide Girls, you can see me naked. Um, I have an Instagram page. I'm Natty Bo, N-A-T-T-Y-B-O-H-H -H on Instagram. Um, if you send me an email or message me on there, I can give you information on how to get onto my Snapchat. Um, you do have to purchase it, but um, you can see me nude on there too, so. Hello! Chilling, listening to Papa Roach. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I really like doing these live streams, too. Um, it's nice to, like, spend time and get to, like, talk to some of y'all. Thanks. Sorry, I'm going to see this. Uh, yeah, so I have, um... A couple things. This bottom, I need to work a little bit on this sleeve. I want to cover up a few things. Um, but um, I have a treasure chest down here. I have um, a mermaid girl. She's in a frame. One of my favorites. I have um, a whale skeleton held by a hand skeleton. Um, 
There's a nautical compass for you. There's the um, stern or the, sorry, the wheel, however you call it. Would you get your favorite bands or artists as a tat? No. I don't, I like don't, I, t band tattoos are cool, but I just, I don't like, uh, yeah, I want to get another tattoo. I have uh, my favorite like games as a tattoo though. Um, I have a Pokemon tattoo and that's a Master Ball. That's Zelda's Master Sword. Um, there's a Navy there. Um, I like video games, but I don't know if I would put my favorite band on there. What's my favorite kind of food? Oh my god. I love all food, guys. I don't discriminate. I don't have like a favorite kind of food because I just love all food so much. <laughs> so, um, I like, I love all food. There's little, there's like, like very little that I really won't eat. Um, I love all food. I work at a restaurant. I'm a fine dining, um, server. I work at a restaurant and, um, I, I love food and that's why I've worked in the restaurant industry so long because I love it and I'm um, currently um, in school to become a nurse and I'm gonna be so sad when I leave the restaurant industry because <laughs> I just I love being in the, I just like being in a restaurant and being in a kitchen and just being like able to eat food all day yay have a good day Michael thanks No, yeah, I wouldn't get a band, but I have Pokemon on my arm because I love Pokemon. And there's not really, like, I'm just, I don't have a band that I really, I don't know. I just, there's nothing, there's not, like, any, yeah, no, no. I, again, I'm not, like, against it. I'm not against the ta the band tattoo. Um, I've seen some incredible, like, band tattoos. Like, I get it, but just, like, how some people like to get band tattoos, I'd rather get, um, a video game tattoo. There's only very limited space that you have to tattoo your body. You know what I'm saying? There's a very limited space. And if there's something I want, you know what I mean? If there's something that I wouldn't really want on there, why would I waste space? You know? Does that make sense? Did someone just say I look like Mia Khalifa because it's literally the most amazing thing? Oops. Sorry. Oh, I turned that. Oh, there we go. What do I do for fun? Um... I get high for fun. I, 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 um, I know it's total stoner and that's basically my life. Like I, I go to school right now. I'm off school, but school starts the semester starts in a week. Um, I usually, I hit the gym, I go to work and I get high. Um, I, I also work as a bartender, um, downtown Baltimore at a really dope music festival. I mean, music, um, music, venue sorry I'm high right now um at a really awesome music venue and um so that's a lot of fun like bartending downtown to awesome shows is really dope too would you date a short guy I don't know I don't maybe I don't know yeah I love the I don't know I like being a server it's fun I have the best friends. We actually like went rock climbing this morning. Like where we don't open on Mondays. Um, my restaurant doesn't open on Mondays, so we all have a day off. So today we, like seven of us, went rock climbing this morning. I'm feeling so strong right now. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, yes, yeah, feeling so strong right now. Um, are my nipples pierced? No. Uh, um, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. I've I've like thought about getting my nipples pierced, and I like. Uh, you know what I mean? I'm like, okay, yeah, I'll go do it. And then it's always been like the person that I'm dating um, has been like, oh, I'm not like really into those. And then I just like, you know what I mean? I'm like, oh, okay, well, I, I don't know. Must be Hard Rock Cafe. No, I work at Soundstage, a music venue, not a music restaurant. call you. <laughs> no. <laughs> Thanks. 
has the group junk food. I don't know, maybe. Um, I don't work every single show, so there's some shows that I, you know what I mean, they may have. I don't know. <laughs> Airhead. Oh, thanks. That's cool. I have a 4.0 GPA, and um, I'm going to school to become a nurse, so I don't think I'm an airhead, but if you want to have that opinion, that's that's cool. <laughs> Andrew. Thanks. Always thought about being a suicide girl, but lost confidence after a while. Regain that motherfucking confidence and become a suicide girl. Um, I have to tell you, I, um, I have wanted to be a suicide girl since I got my first tattoo. Um, I was at that tattoo parlor and, um, I saw like a print of a suicide girl hanging on the wall and I was like, oh my God, like, look at this incredibly tattooed, beautiful babe and like all of her fucking confidence and like, you know, and she wasn't, she wasn't like typical model, you know, and it was, it just like spoke to me, you know, and, um, I went and, you know, I, I was into it. I was into it, but I was younger. I was like 17 at that point. I was like, no, well, that's not my thing. Whatever. You have to be 18 anyways. But, um, and then I moved to Texas and I met some cool people and I just like, I got confident and I started slowly doing a little bit more modeling things. Um, and then when I came back to Maryland, after I lived in Texas for a couple of years, um, I was 20, 21, and that's when I started, like, shooting again a lot, and a really great friend of mine who's also a photographer, his name is Sean Deckerman, I tag him in a lot of my, uh, my, his, my work, but, him, sorry, his work, I tag him in a lot of my pictures, I'm sorry, I'm high, guys, um, and, uh, he, like, shot, uh, he shot my first set, and I submitted it, and um, it actually got rejected because I um, didn't read like what they really wanted, and it was I did um, it was stupid. But um, and I kind of lost my confidence too, and I was like, oh, I'm this is stupid. Like I should have never applied. I'm in no way um, fit for to be a suicide girl, and I just kind of like lost confidence. And one day, the suicide girl burlesque show came to my work at Soundstage um, in Baltimore, and they were there. And, um, the most incredible woman, her name is Sunshine, she came up to me and was like, you should apply for Suicide Girls. And I was like, I have, and I don't, I don't know. And she's like, no, here's my information. Apply to Suicide Girls. I'll, I'll do, you know what I mean? I'll help you whatever you need. And, um, so another really great friend of mine, Henry Riggs, he's twisted on, um, Suicide Girls. He's actually, he's, he's incredible. And he's had like four sets, he's shot four sets the day, um, and he, uh, he shot us out with me and then he, you know, I, I got my confidence back and I started going to the gym and I lost some weight and, um, I got my shit together and, um, I started, I shot another set and, um, you know, then I started to lose confidence again and I was like, I'm not good enough to be a suicide girl. This isn't, you know what I mean? They're not, I don't know. I'm not pretty enough. I don't have enough tattoos. You know what I mean? So I started losing a little bit of confidence and, um, then I, my set got picked and I, uh, you know, of course cried my eyes out and, uh, yeah, that's, I became a suicide girl and it was magical, really. It was really fucking cool. I'm thinking about staying a Suicide Boys group, Susan. There's already a Suicide Boys group. Um, if you're a member of Suicide Girls, there is a Suicide Boys group. Um, so uh, it's like $4 a month, guys. Like, get your membership, and there is a Suicide Boys community on there. So if you want to get naked and have some ladies drool all over you, become a member of Suicide Girls, and then... Since when are you wearing glasses? I've worn glasses my whole life. Let's be for tacos. Yeah, I love tacos. There's a huge spider on the wall by your head. It's so funny. People try to scare me. People do this all the time. They do this like there's a um, a spider near you. There's a bug near you. Um, one of my first jobs as a um, I've always worked um, the restaurants, but usually I always I've always also had two jobs. And one of my jobs while I was working at the restaurants where. Um, I work for Wildlife Adventures, which is um, a group that uh, 
has all these kinds of animals and it was actually my um, best friend's mom and this company and she had all these incredible animals and we would go to birthday parties we would go to fairs and school events we would teach kids about animals and we had reptiles we had lizards we have uh, spiders we had uh, Madagascar hissing cockroaches um, chinchillas so <laughs> I've like handled tarantulas you know what I mean I've like like messed with hissing cockroaches I have literally no fear of bug I have no fear of like really animals so <laughs> that whole like oh no there's a bug next to your head isn't like it doesn't bother me I'll, I'll I would like pick it up gently and put it outside <laughs> you don't have to be, you don't have to have a, a you don't have to be there like you don't need to have a big dick to be a suicide boy <laughs> Oh, like just like you don't have to have tattoos to be a suicide girl. There's girls, there's like beautiful suicide girls like Faye. She's uh, the most beautiful suicide girl. Doesn't even have a tattoo on her body. Si, sí, hablo español. Those are my arm tattoos. Do you like Italy? I've never been to Italy. Somebody fly me to Italy and I'll, um, I'm done to go to Italy. What's the most meaningful tattoo you have? Ooh, that's a good question. Um, okay, the most meaningful tattoo I have is my bee. Um, bees are one of my favorite animals. They've been for a while and, um, we have a serious problem facing our bee population. Um, a colony collapse disorder is a very real thing, friends. And um, bees are dying, and we're um, kind of sure, we're not sure, we're trying to figure out what the fuck's going on, and um, they need your help, the bees need your help, because if bees die, like, food, a lot of our favorite fruits and vegetables, like, are going away, and I love food so much, like, that's why bees are my favorite, because they, like, pollinate plants, so they feed me, and, like, anything that feeds me is just, like, very close to my heart, and we need to save the bees. So, the bee tattoo, um, is probably my, my favorite, because I, it's a conversation piece, people ask me about it all the time, and I get to talk to people about how, um, our bees are dying, and we need to do things to help them, and it can be so easy, like, going on your balcony and planting a bee, um, uh, flowers that attract bees, and, um, giving them, you know what I mean, nature to be at, and it's, it's, yeah, say the bees, guys, if you, um, don't know about it, this, type in bee population on Google, and you can read all about what's, um, the problem, if you're really interested in it, contact me, I'll give you, um, information, but, yeah, bees are insects, uh, what did I, say? yeah, I, bees are animals, I mean, they're in the animal kingdom, um, insects are, like, also animals. Bees, oh, come in. She spelled that wrong. Fat, fat, fat. Thanks. Happy birthday! No, I like bees because of food. I don't like food because of bees. I like bees because they pollinate the flowers that are able, that produce food that I enjoy. They're like essential to having avocados and blueberries and strawberries and all these awesome fruits and vegetables that we get. What do you do in the future? I'm studying to become a nurse. Um, I'm, yeah, I want to be a nurse. I want to, yeah. Nice jiggle, thanks, yeah, they jiggle. The bass player of the, has a ton of the new job. Oh, that's cool. The fuck? Bees are crucial to the environment. Yay! Thank you. Hello, hello, hello. That's okay. You don't have to care. That's fine. I don't. You're. That's fine. Um. There's like people that like deny climate change out there. Like you don't have to, if you don't want to care, you don't have to care. It's your environment. I mean, it's the, it's what you're living on. So, I mean, whatever. Do your thing, friend. I don't judge. Anyways, um, 
It's been really dope hanging out with you guys. Um, I'm going to go take my mom to a Brazilian steakhouse and chow down on some serious steak because it's her birthday. Um, thanks for hanging out. I will um, be back sometime. Um, there's multiple places you can follow me. I am Natty Bo, N-A-T-T-Y-B-O-H-H, -H, um, on Instagram. I'm Natty Bo on Suicide Girls. Um, I'm Natalia Selene on Twitter, I think. I also have a Tumblr. I don't exactly know what my handle is on Tumblr, but I do have a Tumblr. Um, you can find me on there somehow. I don't, uh, I don't, I have a Tumblr. Um, I also have a Snapchat. It's a premium Snapchat, so you have to purchase it, but, um, it's a one-time fee, and you get to see all my nude selfies, and I post a lot of the uncensored pictures, um, on, um, Snapchat. I also have a Patreon account if you, like, really love me and want to um, become a monthly subscriber to me. You get really cool rewards. Um, I sent prints, signed prints. I sent signed in stacks. So that's another thing. I'm patreon.com slash nattybow. Anyways, it's been real. Um, thanks for hanging out with me. Um, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.